And it's about a girl. And her name was Emily. Now, Emily loved to eat cookies. More than anything else in the whole world. She wanted to have cookies for breakfast, cookies for lunch, cookies for dinner, cookies for dessert, cookies all the time. Now, Emily's mother would say to her, Emily, at least try your carrots. Emily's father would say to her, Emily, eat your spinach. But Emily would just say, cookies, eat. <laughs> Well, now, Emily's mother and father tried to trick Emily into eating her food by making her food look like cookies. They'd cut her sandwiches into circles. They'd squish the meatballs flat. They'd slice the cucumbers into little wafers. But Emily could not be tricked. Cookies are nothing at all. Eat. <laughs> well, they did not want Emily to starve, so they let Emily eat cookies. <laughs> they let her have cookies for breakfast, cookies for lunch, cookies for dinner, cookies for dessert, cookies all the time. For breakfast, Emily would eat sugar cookies. On a cold morning, she'd eat oatmeal cookies. For lunch, she'd eat peanut butter cookies. For dinner, she'd have shortbread and gingerbread cookies. And for dessert, chocolate chip cookies. Mm -hmm. Emily ate cookies all the time. Now, because Emily only ever ate cookies, well, she did not grow up the way you and I grow up. Her arms and her legs did not get very long or strong. Her face and her body got to be kind of soft and round. Until Emily sort of started looking like a cookie herself. Yeah, she stood in front of her mirror one day. She said, look at me. I'm a cookie girl. <laughs> And then she ate an entire bag of double fudge cookies. Well, now, one time, Emily had eaten up all the cookies in the house, so her mother went down to the grocery store to get more. And Emily stood out on the front porch of her house waiting for her mother to come back. And when Emily saw her mother coming down the sidewalk with a big bag full of cookies, Emily got so excited she jumped up and she fell down. But she did not fall down the way you and I might fall down, nuh -uh, because you see, Emily was soft and round like a cookie. When she fell down, she began to roll. She rolled right down the front steps. She rolled right into her mother. Oh, her mother fell back. The bag broke open. The cookies scattered all over the sidewalk. But Emily just kept rolling. And she cried out, Help me, help me, spin and whirl. Stop me, stop me. I'm a cookie girl. <laughs> well, Emily's mother got and ran after Emily, saying, My baby! My baby! <laughs> but Emily just kept rolling. Well, now just then, Emily's father was on his way home from work. He was bringing his car around the corner when Emily rolled right in front of his car. He screeched on the brakes. She bounced off the bumper. But Emily just kept rolling. And she cried out, Help me, help me, spin and whirl. Stop me, stop me, I'm a cookie girl. And Emily's mother ran past saying, My baby, my baby. So Emily's father ran right along to her, saying, Emily, stop right now. But Emily just 
Cat Crawley. Well, just then, the mailman was out delivering the mail. He did not see Emily until it was too late. She knocked him back. His bag blew up. The letters scattered all over the yard. But Emily just kept rolling. And she cried out, Help me, help me! Spear me, world! Stop me, stop me! I'm a cookie eater! Emily's mother ran past, saying, My baby! My baby! Emily's father ran past, saying, Emily, stop right now! So, the mailman ran right along to saying, clean up this mess. But Emily just kept rolling. She rolled right down to the traffic light. It was a red light. Now Emily knew better than to cross that red light without somebody to hold her hand, but she couldn't stop. She rolled right through the intersection. The car swerved, the trucks honked, the policewoman blew her whistle. But Emily yeah. just kept rolling. And she cried out, Help me, help me, spin and whirl. Stop me, stop me, I'm a cookie. Emily's mother ran past saying, My baby, my baby. Emily's father ran past saying, Emily, stop right now. The mailman ran past saying, Clean up this mess. So, the policewoman ran right along too, saying, little girl, pull over. But Emily just kept rolling. She rolled right down to the grocery store. She rolled right through the grocery store door. She bumped into the bad boys. She bruised the bananas. She banged into the baked goods. But Emily just and she cried out, Help me, help me, spin in the world! Stop me, stop me, I'm a good teacher! Emily's mother ran past saying, My baby, my baby! Emily's father ran past saying, Emily, stop right now! The mailman ran past saying, Clean up this mess! The policewoman ran past saying, Little girl, pull over! So, all of the bad boys and the checkers and the customers in that grocery store ran right along too, saying, what was that? <laughs> but Emily, <laughs> well, she rolled and she rolled and she rolled and she rolled and she rolled right past the frozen fish. She rolled right past the dairy case. She rolled right past the soup cans and the cereal. She rolled and she rolled till she rolled right into the cookie, the cookie shell. And the boxes of cookies and bags of cookies all broke open and cookies completely covered Emily. And finally, Emily stopped rolling. And her mother and her father and the mailman and the policewoman and the bad boys and the checkers and the customers in that grocery store all gathered around that giant pile of cookies. They started putting the cookies away, looking for Emily. They put the box cookies back in their boxes. They put the bag cookies back in their bags. They put the bags and the boxes back on the shelves. And when they had cleared all the cookies away, Emily was gone. <laughs> and the bad boys and the checkers and the customers in that grocery store all said, that's really weird. <laughs> the policewoman said, poor kid. The mailman said, what a mess. Emily's father said, Emily ate too many cookies anyway. Emily's mother said, my baby.
A voice spoke out from the cookie shelf, saying, Yum, yum, spin and whirl. I am happy in here. I'm a cookie girl. Now, I don't know if that's really a true story, but I do know this. Every time I go to the grocery store and I buy myself a box or a bag of cookies, I take it home, I open it up, I look inside. You know, there's always at least one cookie in there that's kind of crumbled, <coughs> like it's been nibbled on. So I figure maybe Emily really is out there, nibbling on all of those cookies. I guess you could say, that's the way the cookie crumbles. Uh -huh. That's the story oh, of the cookie girl. <laughs>